<laughs> my, my, what a happy family. <laughs> <laughs> now, Ishwari, darling, move Lakshmana to the left. RJ, tell your mother and sister to... No! What have you done? No, it wasn't me. It was... <laughs> you can't lie about who you are. Not in here. Ishwari, are you in here? And what is this? It's a pen. Yes, yes, I know it's a pen. I mean, why are you giving it to me? I thought it was a nice memento to remind you of my love. But if you don't want it... <laughs> It's the best gift I've ever received. Don't hold me. I know you and too well. Great I can tell you hate. Stop, stop. This is too <laughs> much. I think of you every time I use it, Ishwari. I hate sad endings. cultural image as you requested sir may i present to you ishwari gale the tarun matara my king Ooh. kirat's living goddess bowing to me oh i could get used to this well now come on get up come here i could use some better company How I long for those days. I guess that's the end of the story, huh? You can go back now. Out the way you came. Oh, good. Floating rocks in a sea of darkness. Seems like a great place for a nursery. Come on, the pagan. 
you could do this. Well, tell your husband it's his. He will find that hard to believe. Then tell him it's an immaculate conception. They think you're a goddess, right? Isn't that sort of thing in your wheelhouse? Or I can contact my private doctor. He'll know what we can do about this. Hmm? How dare you! Oh, come on, Ishwari. Do I really strike you as the kind of man who's eager for divers of playtime? And do I strike you as the kind of woman who can be told what to do with her body? <sighs> well, a boy can dream, can't he? Isn't she? I mean, she's going to look like me, so that's already helping her. You know, people like babies, and you, you're the offspring of their king and their goddess. They have to love you, don't they? <laughs> Wouldn't you like to be Papa's prop, my love? Grow up just as I did? Strike down your daddy for me. Yes, that's a good girl. Of course. this you've seen everything you can go back now if you want if you've seen enough if you want to leave you can go back out it's okay This is my father's place, all right. I can smell this terrible cologne already. Ugh. Self-control. I have turned a blind eye to your vices, but the fact that you are still are still fucking men. <laughs> oh, please. What's the point of having power if you can't do whatever you You touched my face. <sighs> I wasn't planning on doing this so soon. But you dare? No, smart! I'm lying! Has a hell of a back! Snow me now! Now, where was I? Oh, right. Coming, my darlings. Ugh. I hate reruns.
done your job. Now unfreeze my accounts. Give me back my fucking money. Your money. <laughs> I have had enough of your frivolities. You waste my wealth. And on what? Woman's clothing and flashy cars? You attract too much attention. I'm trying to uphold our status. You could be running the triad. I heard what you did. Would you press it to me? Look at your fucking shoes. Disgusting. All these memories can make me angry. Oh, now this is nice. <sighs> Who is it? Sir, you wanted to see me? Ah, yes, you must be da -da 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 -da. Ah, Eric, the body double. Come in, come in, let's take a look at you. Mm, a little shorter than I had hoped. But you have a wonderful physique. Mm, they really did get my cheekbones right, didn't they? Mm. Mm. Ah, fond memories. Understand. Stop the bus. If 
you've seen enough, if you want to leave, you can go back out. It's okay. <laughs> up about this sudden loss, but it's time for you all to make a choice. One, you stay and work for me. Two, you end up like dear old dad here. Good. Oh, and one more thing. I'm renaming myself. You see, I too am a king who isn't afraid to slaughter anyone even family, to get what he wants. So from now on, call me... Pagan Men. Ah, Yuma, finally. The time has come, my dear. Are you... <laughs> I see. A beautiful, perfect mask. Same old, same old. Just hide what you are. I'm not hiding. I'm... enhancing. Listen to me! Regardless of how you feel, Ishwari is a spy, Pagan! A spy? Oh, heavens, how can this be? This must be the real reason my greatest adversary sent his own wife into my home. Oh, you are you. Genius, you absolute genius. You. No. Then why did you... Because I am the king. And a king destroys anyone who gets in between him and what he wants. <laughs> She told Mohan of his wife's affair, didn't she? <laughs> it's funny, you know. You always needed a mother. It just came too late. There's my girl. I kept my promise. This made the king furious. He promised that what happened to the goddess would never happen again. Ugh, thank God. This was worth doing after all. Disgusting religion built on pain and exploitation, and I won't let them do to our daughter what they did to you. Storm the temples, take anything we can sell, destroy the rest. Artifacts were melted down and turned into statues of the king because the truth was the king never cared about the goddess at all He was just jealous. He wanted everyone to love him and him alone Even though he lied and lied no one was fooled the king was hated alone and deserved to die for what he did the end I was Lakshmana! too late. No! Okay. No, my baby! <laughs> oh, no! <laughs> you knew what Mohan was like, and you did nothing. <laughs> did it. Well, it's complete. 
Does this mean you need it? Daddy! He's done it! Now you can come and find me! Hurry! I'm waiting for you! Devastated by the loss of his family, King Pagan threw himself into battle. More pathos. The king would never let that wild terrorist take another smile from him. No! And so he laid down his life, not only to protect his adopted son, but to save all of Kirat. No! Don't leave me! Don't leave me! <laughs> oh, Love this country as I loved you, and as I love your mother. Oh, so this is what we're telling people now, are we? Oh, what an utterly impressive crock of shit. Daddy? Thank you for remembering me. I know you can't really save me, but this is enough. I just want you to know, you're absolutely perfect. Everything that's ever happened, it's not your fault. Mohan, Yuma, those filthy terrorists, they're the bad guys, not you. I love you, Daddy. I always will. I did it all for you. I'd give everything away to be with you. I have. I've learned Ishwari. I'm flawless now. I really am. <laughs> RJ, pass the crab rangoon, will you? <laughs> what is this? Oh! <laughs> Recording, I am dead. Or just, you know, on vacation or something. Doesn't really matter. I'm sure by now you're busy silencing dissidents and enjoying lavish clifftop dinners. I just have one last thing to mention. You don't think I really sunk all this country's money into gold statues, do you? Don't be stupid. No, I was starting to get a little tired of America meddling in my personal affairs without consequence. I mean, closing trade, sending the CIA, trying to hire you to off me or something. I, it really pissed me off. So, beneath this palace is, well, what would you call it? A, a stock? A heap? A gaggle? An enormous fucking vault of nuclear weapons, a fuck ton of them, pointed right at America. Probably, I don't know, somewhere near Montana, to be exact. Doesn't matter. Feel free to use them whenever and however you see fit. Oh, oh but if I am alive, do warn me first, would you? Enjoy the power, RJ. You deserve it. Love always, Uncle Pagan. Now, how do I press...